And a little bit of shake, rattle, and roll. Well, it turns out Ohio is actually no stranger to earthquakes. A five on your side investigation has found a major fault line runs right through Northeast Ohio. Chief Investigator Ron Regan continues our live team coverage with what he has found. Ron? Well, this is a fault line running roughly from Akron in Summit County, northeast all the way into Ashtabula County. And across Ohio, we found 45 earthquakes have hit the state in just the last five years, two-thirds of them right in our part of the state. This seismograph at the Museum of Natural History recorded the quake as it happened. It took just one minute and 28 seconds to reach Cleveland. Hank Burns was playing his harmonica when it struck. And I just felt this building behind me uh, just, uh, just rattling for about a second and a half. Scientists say it's possible for a similar size quake to hit here. Magnitude 5.5 earthquake could be generated right here in northeastern Ohio. What kind of damage would that do in downtown Cleveland? You know, it would shake the place up. People in uh, taller buildings would feel it. People down in the lower floors or basement or driving might not even feel it. It could crack some walls and knock some things off the shelf and off the walls. Elizabeth Gossler was working 30 floors up when the quake hit. And I was just sitting there and all of a sudden I could feel like a little tremor. Maybe 15, 20 seconds. And here's what it would have looked and felt like. Shaking a lot and it's hard to talk. I can imagine things falling. And the museum has a simulated earthquake room. And scientists warn we could feel more real shaking in the days ahead. That's a possibility. So over the next couple of days we may hear that some lower magnitude earthquakes will be taking place in eastern Canada or northeastern United States. And those 45 quakes that have hit Ohio in the last five years have registered about four to four and a half on the Richter scale. Although the last big quake was in Geauga County in 1986, and that registered 5.0. Live in Cleveland, I'm Chief Investigator Ron Regan. Okay, Ron, thank you. We have had hundreds of viewer comments on Facebook and Twitter. Danette said she thought it was funny. She was soaking in the tub and could feel it move. And Teresa Rodini writes, I felt a tremor shaking my chair and the crystal hanging in my window was swinging back and forth. And we had more than 100,000 page hits on our website, newsnet5.com, in just one hour after the earthquake rocked Northeast Ohio. If you felt anything or have pictures, let us know. Post your comments on our Facebook or Twitter page and submit your photos to newsnet5.com.